A winded man who responded to a plea for a kidney donation says that he is scheduled to undergo surgery next week. WMTW News 8 broke this story in November when a 23 year old South Portland woman began advertising for a donor on the back of her car. WMTW News 8's Katie Thompson is live tonight at Maine Medical Center in Portland with more. Katie? Tracy, the wife of that kidney donor tells me that the surgery is scheduled for a week from tomorrow, June 16th, here at the Maine Medical Center Transplant Center. That is the only program of its kind in the state. Now, Ashley Dahl Layton, who is the wife of Joshua Dahl Layton, tells me that Joshua is scheduled for surgery at 6 30 that morning to remove his kidney. She says the 23 year old Christine Royals will then immediately undergo surgery to receive his kidney. When Joshua Dahl Layton made that decision back in April, he started a crowdsourcing page to collect donations for medical expenses, and those donations quickly poured in, totaling more than $49,000 in just two months. But the surgery was then delayed. Hospital officials saying they needed time to determine whether the donations violated the National Organ Transplant Act, which forbids potential donors from profiting from a donation. Now, we received a statement earlier today from May Medical Center that says, in part, quote, following an external legal review, we are now confident. That moving ahead with the transplant procedure will comply with federal laws that are designed to regulate organ transplants and protect living donors. Now, we reached out to Christine Royals today but did not hear back. And as for Joshua, Ashley tells me he's scheduled for an all day pre op visit here at Maine Med tomorrow. We're live in Portland tonight. I'm Katie Thompson, WMTW News 8.